Come on! For an evil lair? That's a pretty weak lock. I bet you're wondering why I'm here. And what I know. I know this is one of Lexa's little tree houses. I know. <laughs> My friend Connor has been accused of murdering him. And that's bullshit. And I know Luther's been researching me. Since you're here, I'm going to assume you know why. My name is Nelson Blake. I didn't ask you that. And I'm done asking any questions. Speak. It wasn't just Luther. The whole LexCor inner circle died last night, choking on their own blood. I'm the only one who's still alive. I came here looking for answers. I don't know why Luther was researching you. Maybe, maybe you thought you could help him. Help him with what? Nelson. <laughs> there is absolutely nothing LexCorp can do to you later that I won't do to you right now. Help him with what? Luther's illness changed him. He withdrew. None of us had any personal contact with him for over a year. It was rumored he got caught up in the occult. Surrounded himself with a bunch of advisors. He stopped fighting the disease and started fighting death itself. What kind of advisors? Doctors. Healers. Some archaeologist woman. Nelson? Do you hear that? Hear what? It sounds like chanting. Help me. Please. scene. Whatever happened here, they won't hide it. They can't hide it from me. Yeah, Connor was right. Someone used magic. How do you know? Because all magic leaves a trace. In the physical world, things pass. But beyond the veil, things remain like echoes. So I should be able to get a sense of whoever did this. This is where Alexander died. I don't know who did it, but I've seen where they've been. <laughs> 